Welcome to video number two out of the six week traffication process training course. The art to study and get certified in just six weeks. We're gonna go through the most effective way to go through videos. Because let me tell you something and I need you to write this down. The way that you approach and doing something makes a huge difference and the outcome that you're gonna get from doing that. In this case, you're going through a video, the outcome will be how much will you be able to learn from the video. So again, the way that you approach the process and going through a video makes a huge difference. And that's exactly the process that we're gonna go through in this video. That way you know better and how to go through any video from now on. And I will tell you, it will dramatically help you to learn a lot more compared and how you are probably learning from a video right now. So take notes. So let's go through this process. You go through a video not once, but twice. You go through a video not once, but twice. And this is exactly what I tell my students. You better go through the videos, not once, twice. Now, the way that you go and doing that is by doing this. Let's say that you go through a video training course, 20 videos total. You go through them, not by, oh, let me go through the 20 videos and once I'm done, I'm gonna go back and go through all of them again. Don't do that. That's not the right way of doing this. Obviously, you're gonna start with video number one. So you're gonna go through video number one. And once you're done, right away, you go back and you go through video number one again. That's exactly how you need to go through the videos. Now, let's say video number 10. Video number 10, it's about 20 minutes. And you're thinking, okay, I'm gonna go through this video today, but tomorrow, I'm gonna go through it again. No, you don't do that. You better have the time to go through the video twice the same day. So what that means, once you go through video 10, you go back right away and you go through the same video, video 10 again. That's exactly how you need to go through the videos. Any videos that you're gonna go on watching from now on. Now, that's just one thing for you to do. Going through the videos, not once, but twice. Now. The way that you go through the video the first time and the way that you go through the video the second time matters a lot. So take note. Because the way that you need to go through the video the first time is by not taking any notes, by not stopping the video, and by not rewind the video. And I know we are conditioned to do that. We go through something new to us. And obviously because it's new, we take the time to, oh, let me write this down. Oh, let me stop the video. Oh, I didn't get this. Let me rewind the video. You don't do that. The first time that you go through a video, you do not take any notes. You do not stop the video. And you do not rewind the video at any moment. You focus and be ready to go through that 10, 20 minute video without taking any notes, without stopping the video or rewinding the video. So what you're supposed to do is you need to think on everything. Let's say you are going through one of my videos in this video training course. You need to think, process, and analyze, and write this down. You need to think, process, and analyze everything that I'm teaching you, everything that I'm walking you through. And then you're gonna come up and ask how this can help me. So throughout the video, you think, you process, you analyze, and then you come up with this question, how this can help me? How? And then, how this applies to me? So you see now? Now you are telling your mind what to do. You are now telling your mind, do something with this based on where I'm at right now. Because going through a video, it's not for you to know everything, for you to learn everything. It's for you to learn, for you to know what you need based on where you are right now that's going to allow you for you to move on, for you 
to move forward. That's exactly how you need to go through a video and what you need to get out of the video. And this will completely change the way that you learn and how much you learn from each video that you're gonna go on watching from now on. So once again, once again, the first time that you go through the video, you do not take any notes. You do not stop the video and you do not rewind the video. The only thing you do, you think, you process, you analyze, and throughout the process you have to question and be like, okay, how this can help me? How this applies to me? And that's the first time that you go through the video. Now, the second time, your mind knows better because now the information, the content, it's not new. You just went through it and you process it the right way. So now your mind will be able to do a lot more once you go through that video the second time. And now it's up to you if you want to take any note, if you want to stop the video, if you want to rewind the video. It's up to you, but you only do that the second time that you go through that video. And, do, and going through this process, it's like, when you go, I know that you probably watch some movies, not once, not twice, a few times. And you notice that probably the third time that you went through that movie, you noticed something or you realized like, oh my God, I didn't see that when I went through the first or the second time. You see, it gets to a point where the mind realized that. But if you program your mind to really go through and just get, again, everything that you need, everything that you have to learn, based on where you are right now, this is gonna allow you to move forward, to move on, you will be able to do that by going through this process. So do this, and I know it will change. So once again, how this can help me and how, the, how this applies to me. So now you know what to do the next time you're gonna go on watching the next video. So now let's go through this video and talk about the biggest mistake that everyone, if not everyone, a ton of people make in the IT community when learning a technical topic from a video. And obviously, you know better because you went through video number two, so you know how to go through a video. So if I ask you, now that you know better, what would you think it will be one big mistake that many people make now in the IT community and that probably you were making a few days before? What would that mistake be? And that obviously is thinking that it's enough going through the video once. You do not go through my videos or any videos from this point on once, right? So what's the right way of doing it? You go through the videos twice. Now let me ask you, how you go through the videos twice? What would your answer be? Because obviously you know better and do not go and look at your notes. This is something that you better know by now. This is why I'm going through this video again, just to make sure that you are doing this right. So now, if I come up to you and I ask you, what would be the best way for me to go through any video? What would your answer be? And yes, obviously, do not go through a video once, go through a video twice. What else? How I, how I need to go through a video uh, twice? How? Tell me how. What would you answer me? Remember, the way that you go through a video once makes a huge difference. If you don't go through a video once, the way that I ask you to, it doesn't matter if you go through a video even three times. So now that you know better, go and do that. You go through the video the first time by not taking any notes, by not stopping the video or rewinding the video. And when you do that, you are really conditioning your mind to focus because now you are not allowing your mind to be distracted by going to the phone, by opening another window on the computer, or by doing something else. Because now your mind knows that it's not allowed to, for you to make notes, stop the video, rewind the video. And again, what else? Went through the video the first time. The way that you're gonna go on learning and process what you are learning, right? And that's based on, okay, how this will help me. How this applies to me. And you do that by thinking, by process. 
and analyze everything that you are watching, everything that you are learning. So make sure you go and do that. So that's one huge mistake that a lot of people make, yeah, right? Going through a video not once, twice. So now that you know better, go and do that. So I'm gonna ask you right now for you to download the PDF and do the exercise. Go through the questions. Because now I'm gonna ask you for you to, how will you teach it? So let's go to the next level. So it's not now for you to know what to do, but how will you teach it? And I'm gonna ask him one question, go and teach it to someone else that is going through videos. Go and do that. And let's see how effective you are in teaching that to other people. This process that we are going through is not only for you to go based on going through the videos, doing the exercises, but for you to apply and for you to obviously practice because that's how the mind works. And you're gonna learn a ton of more later on. But right now that you know better, it's not just that you have to know better, but now go and teach it to someone else on how they need to go through a video. So do that. Go through the exercise and then do that. And once you're done, go to the next video and I will talk to you there.